done work with both for-profit and non-profit organizations over many years. And last but not least, Craig Newmark, founder of Craigslist and board member of Craigslist. And Craig, I'm going to let you kick things off uh, with an interesting announcement. As of today, I've been reflecting a lot about how to do a lot of uh, real stuff. Um, you know, I'm a nerd. It uh, may be obvious from my tweets that I'm also a couch potato. And uh, my job, for the most part of Craigslist, is a is customer service rep. Not chief customer service rep. I have no management role. But the deal is I'm impatient. I view things from the bottom up from the grassroots or rank and file perspective, and I'm lazy. So I figure I'd like to find a way to uh, convince you to basically engage everyone on the world over a 20 year period to work together for common good, to get things going so that I can uh, fully uh, maintain and follow through my couch potato uh, observations. Which, there is some really good TV I'm uh, behind on, like Buffy, <laughs> and it's about time I, uh, I caught up with that. You know, the deal is that there should be some way, some lightweight, serious, real way that everyone in the world can connect in a way that also that where we protect each other while we're doing this. The beginning of the idea, and it's only a beginning, because I'm not all that smart, is that, well, I've observed that with very little fanfare, I'm now supporting about 100 different uh, nonprofits, uh, related governmental organizations, doing serious stuff from the bottom up, helping people up. What I want to do is find a way, probably using some combination of Facebook and Twitter, because that's what I know, where people can stand up for each other, can just bear witness for each other, saying, hey, these guys are doing a good job. It's a kind of vetting and then maybe also document in very briefly, because I have a short attention span, um, what, one, well, what I've done for these groups. The deal is that I will find a way to do that. And then the ask, I'm gonna ask of everyone that I'm doing it for, is to stand up to bear witness for other groups who are doing this kind of stuff, and then maybe point back to me, because then I'll be standing up for other groups so the idea is to try to find a real way to propagate this across the entire world over a 20-year period. I'm a nerd. I read science fiction. We think that way. I can go on and on about this. I won't. The problem is that I also see, talking to some of these groups, that once you get noticeable, once you get traction and some power, what may happen to you is what happened to Aiken. And so there are people out there who are, this is already happening to. There's an article going around it's called Rogues of K Street, where they actually talk about how they're planning on doing this to other groups, and frankly, how it's happened already to me, and I'm keeping faith with people who are protecting other people, and I will take the heat and do what it takes to keep the faith and I will continue to do that until sometime, at some point, somebody gives me a break and we can finally talk about it. Because we don't want more acorn situations happening out there. But the deal is, this is the ask I'm going to be making of you. It's harder than you think. Because whenever this happens, you need to be able to do things like preventing uh, attacks like what happened to acorn. You've got to do some research and you've got to do what's necessary to stand up. But I've started a 20-year voyage to boldly go where no nerd has gone before, <laughs> and I'm going to follow through. Oh, Revenue is a soul of work. I'm done. Craig, I did want to ask you one question. If people leave here and want to follow you on your path into outer space, outer politics, where can they follow this adventure? Um, my blog, cnewmark.com, uh, Twitter, Craig Newmark, and I'm on Facebook, it's Craig Newmark. 
you will have to put up with my sense of humor. And for those of you who are already following me on Twitter, I promise you that I am not common squirrel. I am merely a devotee. That would be hilarious if you saw common squirrel. Well, this gives us a, an excellent entree to talk about um, an element of the future that is already with us.